my product that I'm gonna be uh, talking about today <laughs> is the 47 hour energy bar. <laughs> Finally, <laughs> right? Okay. <laughs> Are you like me? <laughs> Do you find yourself getting dreary and weary at the 46th hour? And I kept on finding that around the 46th hour, I would start to get tired. Uh, and I needed something to get me through that. Wait, this is gonna be the size of it? That is the size of it. How much of it do you need to eat to get your food? The whole bar. If you want all 47 hours, you're gonna have to eat the whole thing. <laughs> Say that you need 23 and a half hours. Right about there. <laughs> get ready for it. Okay. <laughs> so the first product is... Tire baby. <laughs> it's a tire that is also uh, cutely designed to be a baby toy. <gasps> what? <laughs> <laughs> we found that a lot of um, parents who were expecting and didn't want to know the sex of their babies, they need gender neutral to toys. And what we did was we took the best of both worlds. Obviously we know little girls love to have babies and have an uh, innate nurturing thing for them. And then we know boys are you know rough and tumble and they like cars and motorcycles and dirt and, and tires. <laughs> <laughs> and we have new scents that are going out to market. And what we're doing here is we are workshopping the campaign, just getting your honest feedback. So uh, we have two fragrances. <laughs> what is it, Sal? Uh, Eve Compensa. <laughs> this is a, a smell from France, a fragrance from France. Uh, we sell it in very, very small portions, but it has a very huge appeal. <laughs> she knows what he's talking about. Uh, here we have. Uh, <laughs> Mother's musk. Oh. What is more beautiful and more natural than motherhood? The first smell that you smell when you come into this world is your mother's musk. Oh, God. It's not like we're putting a little bit of placenta in each bottle. Yeah, which we tested. That didn't work out. <laughs> Maybe if I tell you about the commercial. A mother is giving birth. And, and, and the doctor is in front of her delivering it. Instead of a baby, out comes a hand holding a, a perfume bottle. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> and the doctor holds it up and then sprays some on and then goes out to a play. <laughs> that is not a good ad campaign. <laughs> And not a lot of people are gonna relate to that. Can you relate to a fine suit, a handsome gentleman in a nice car? You sure can. With overcompensa. Overcompensate? What? <laughs> overcompensate? Overcompensa. <laughs> overcompensate. That's Tiny package, That's big smell. It's not just for guys with little <laughs> it's for everybody. It's for all <laughs> Uh, Al? You called him Al? <laughs> Sal. 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 Okay, cool. Sorry, I'm out. No problem. And here we go. Okay, uh, we'll just start. Uh, Dwayne, do you have a nickname? No. No, no nickname. Uh, okay, uh, Al, do you have a nickname? <laughs> Sal. Um, <laughs> Baloney Cheeks. <laughs> so where, where did you get the nickname Baloney Cheeks? Friends gave it to me. Yeah. It's relatively new. <laughs> it's relatively new. <laughs> Stuck, huh? It better not stick. <laughs> <laughs> You're coming out hot right away, Thank you. Uh, okay, let me ask you another one. Please think about smartphones. What comes to mind, Courtney? Apps taking pictures. Perfect. That was an excellent answer. But you know who I think is going to have a better answer? <laughs> Al? <laughs> Al. Okay. Um, Al, think about smartphones. What comes to mind? The time that I accidentally sent a naked selfie to my sister. Oh my God. <laughs> And then she sent one back, so. <laughs> Great answer. And she sent one back. Wait a second. She sent back a naked, a naked picture of herself? He's turned the screws. We've all been there. No. 
don't know. Next question. Steven, you want to start with it? What do you do for fun? Uh, I play basketball in my local community center. OK. Al? <laughs> it's Al. Al. So I thought I said Sal, and you said it's Al. No, it's, it's been Sal since I was born. <laughs> and what do you do for fun? Uh, I love to paint. Paint? Mm -hmm. What do you paint? <laughs> There's more than that answer. What I wrote here was, uh, I use acrylic paint and a mirror between my legs. <laughs> it's a, it's art, man. Okay, I'm just not understanding how it it's works. It's art. It's subjective. <laughs> Dude, it's gloating. He's got something up his sleeve. What are you painting? I do whatever it takes to uh, make art. Uh, very unclear on what's, what it means. <laughs> you got to answer, buddy. I guess I, I don't know. I might, maybe I taint paint. <laughs> Thank you for joining us. My name's James. Uh, hello, I'm Brian. What we do is we show you sample products. We're the inventors of the said product. Let's get started. OK. Gentlemen first. Uh, OK, I have, uh, that's right, waterproof bread. <laughs> have you ever been in the rain? Have you ever been hungry? You're welcome. <laughs> this product, uh, it's a pregnancy test. Self-destructing pregnancy tests. <laughs> this is a self-destructing pregnancy test. There's no way Murray's winning it. Tell, tell us about the uh, the self-destructing pregnancy test. Q, is that going to bond? It, 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 des it destroys itself whether the results are positive or negative. 10 seconds after you take the pregnancy test, it does explode. Remember, don't uh, piss on the way. <laughs> what is the point? The reason it explodes is that pregnancy is a matter between you and your partner. And it's no one else's business. So it explodes to destroy the evidence. We have a demo video. <laughs> Apparently, I've got a demo video to show you. Let's take a look. <laughs> and that's it. You start with a bang, and it ends with a bang. <laughs> <laughs> 